Ciao ragazzi! In March I visited my husband's family in Verona and Venice and I thought why don't I film some Italian food content? So this is my fifth time visiting and each time when we go there we have really good Italian homemade food and also we go to the restaurants that locals usually go to. When I ask an Italian which city to visit in Italy they would say something oh visit this or that city because se mangia bene which means in translation oh they eat really well there. In other words Italians love their food and food permeates every aspect of their life. So in this context I thought having the exposure of eating at home, uh, food cooked by Italians, why don't I share that with you? So I'll give you five dishes cooked during five different days and let me know in the comments if it's something that you expected of Italians, is it different or similar to the food that you had when you visited Italy or maybe you didn't visit Italy but you saw it on television and you just wanted to compare. Anyways, my name is Elena and for those who are new to my channel, I'm an expat living and working in Ukraine, but right now being relocated due to the war. And without further ado, let's see the dishes! Risotto con fragole e gamberetti. Salmone, olio d'oliva, aglio, prezzemolo. And it goes here. Eh, 30 minuti, uh -huh. 30, 35 minuti. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. E qua va la pasta. Pasta con salmone. Uh -huh. E se prezzemolo? Prezzemolo. Ribolla gialla. Di uh, Verona, di Venezia, di... Veneto. Veneto. Uh -huh. uh, frizzante. Limoni ah. con alcol, acqua e zucchero. Questo sono oli essenziali del limone. Per l'aroma? L'aroma esce dalla buccia, uh -huh. è olio proprio, uh -huh. olio della buccia. Versacca.
You would think this is only dessert, but no, it's lemon ice cream with vodka. Cosa stiamo mangiando? Colomba con profitero. Però io ho messo anche crema rustica. Fatto in casa. Fatto in casa. Nada. Questo è grappa e arancia. E il secondo? No, no, no questo, questo è... Ah, di Moldavia, ok. <ride> Costine al tamaro, poi spaghetti, cecco, aglio, aglio olio e poi peperoncino. It's 6.45, pizza is coming at 8.30, so until then, we will eat some antipasti. Let me show you what we have on the table. This is artichoke, and by the look of it, it's some pickled, parmigiano, then mostarda. Mostarda is a mix of um, uh, pickled vegetables with honey and with mustard. This one is from onion, red onion, and this one are fruits. So they usually have pears, apples, cherries. This is one of my favorite. It really goes well with the cheese and it's a strange combination. And here we have three type of olives. Oof. I honestly don't know how it's going to taste. It smells like gorgonzola, but a salami. and eat the soft part that is closer to the root. It's gentle, it's smoked, has some lemon on it, and also some sort of sauce that is inside. Unexpectedly delicious. Well guys, thank you so much for watching. What do you think? Were the dishes that I presented really representative and you expected Italian street food like that or was it more on the different side? Anyways, there are more videos about Italy here, so feel free to click and watch my Italian content even more. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.